I'm Mick Leisner. I started out as a photographer shooting regular commercial photography underwater. Shooting underwater is so much more interesting. Obviously a magnitude more complicated than regular photography. That sometimes works in our favor and sometimes not. Now when we shoot in the ocean, we have so many different things we have to obey. We have current, we have a lot of marine life. The models, you know, they have to be dedicated and they have to be in a healthy condition. They also have to love the water in order to perform. You need clarity and you also need the temperature. You know, you can't have models underwater and be freezing cold. Colors are also very interesting. The water takes, you know, a certain spectrum out of the sunlight. Every law that we know on land is out of commission. What's really cool is the suspension of gravity. Actually, you have negative gravity because things float up. And that's actually not so much interesting. You can do anything on land. You will never have the flow of the hair, the flow of bubbles, the whole gravity thing replicated. And that's what we can do underwater. And all these issues combined make every photo shoot a big challenge to overcome. So that's why we're here. Hi, my name's Beck Piquet. I'm a producer for Mick Leisner Underwater Photography. Yep, all the models on the bunker, please. We're just about to start the new underwater calendar with the new set of models that have just arrived. Producing an underwater photography shoot means basically making it happen. Oh, I want a deadline here and I want to Everything from logistics. I think this is the location of all locations. To organizing the girls. Now, what we're actually doing is taking you in two at a time. The divers, the weather. <laughs> just about everything to make the actual shoot happen on the day. Working with Mick Gleisner is a challenge. Can you get me back? Back! Where's the diet coke? I ordered the diet coke an hour ago. Oh, number one. Makeup? I, I know. know. I know that actually. Diet coke. I'm not going to shoot unless I have a diet coke. He's not going to get on board or underwater until we get a diet coke. I'm going to get the diet coke! Yeah. He's a very unique artist, always wanting to push the envelope and do something different. Yeah, Mermaid is easy, but not Mermaid Academy. Nobody else that wants to start a Mermaid Academy in this planet. Um, so it's an exciting job. So let's make it a good one, okay? Yeah! I'm Freya. No stress. Sun's out. And I work alongside Beck. At the moment, we're getting together a calendar for Mick Gleisner Underwater Photography. And it's my job to make sure that we have all of the models up to speed, dive certified, we get them training so that they are ready to shoot for the underwater calendar. It's a bit of a concern, maybe we should have a word to her if you want to have We've just brought in a new set of models to be trained up for the underwater shoots with Mick. It's going to be really challenging. I don't think any of the models know what they've got themselves into. Are you okay? Yeah. A lot of models come here and they think it's going to be easy, it's going to be a holiday, but it's not. You're going to need to toughen up. Hi, my name is Anya. Hi, I'm Lacey Black. Hi, my name is Ting. Hi, my name is Krista Kelly. My main focus for modeling is latex, uh, goth, bondage, industrial, and in this case, underwater modeling. I am a high fashion model. I mostly do runway, TV commercials, and music videos. I specialize in the junior market. I do fashion shows, back to school, commercial, print ads, 17 magazine, things that are mostly happy. I specialize in runway and high fashion on the catwalk. I, I model in LA and also in New York. Enjoy. You better bring a towel, because it's gonna get wet. So, our latest special, how are they doing? I think they're all very different personality-wise. Anya mm. seems very sort of confident and sort of outspoken and a little bit sort of, I don't know, a little bit in your face. Just <laughs> tell me about it. Then. Yeah. Ting seems really great, really bubbly and sort of mm -hmm. very friendly. Lacey 
I don't know where she's coming from, actually. She's given me different impressions every time I've seen her. She seems a little bit precious. Mm -hmm. Crystal, Crystal's very tall and very skinny, but she seems okay, she's quite quiet. Patty went really, really well. They've all passed with flying colours. The instructor was very impressed, actually, so they were very confident. So that's good news. Anya's got a bit of a sore ear at the moment. We don't know if it's from that. Okay, good. I really would like for you to consider a couple of days in Palawan. Awesome. Great, you know, visual. You have, you've got the west coast with the sunset. Yep, yep. Great dive spots that okay. I think would really work. All right. I gotta show you guys that, that area. I'm a little bit worried about Anya's ear. You can't just stop production no. one now. That's right? true. We've only got six weeks. We have to get everything within that time frame. Okay, that sounds like a plan. I'll schedule it. We'll make okay. it happen. Cool. Thanks. Loving it. Congratulations for passing your scuba certification. And we'll be doing our first test shoot in the ocean. I'm able to give these girls more training, more one-on-one. -on -one. You go underwater. Okay, ladies. Firstly, congratulations for passing your scuba certification. Thank well you. done. Thank you. You're all now Patty certified. How was it? Awesome. Good. Yeah, I heard everyone did really well. You've actually been an incredibly good group of models. So you passed with flying colors, which is great. But usually what we would do is we would start you off by doing a test shoot in the underwater studio, which is that we have here on location. But because you all seem to be a very athletically inclined group, so Mick has decided and we're gonna head to Palawan and we'll be doing our first test shoot in the ocean. We have a deadline. So we're bringing in Christina, consultant for Mick Leisner Photography. Hi, my name's Christina. I've shot with Mick Leisner before. He asked me actually to stay on board and help train the new models. Christina, can I have goggles? Hi. I've been through the process before. I'm able to give these girls more training, more one-on-one. -on -one. Us being models, we really need that. Crystal, 36. Good job. Frey and Beck have so much to do. They have to prep for the shoot. They have to find locations. Their hands are dabbling in everything. Hopefully I can help out. It's our first morning here in Palawan and we have a huge day ahead of us. Lots of things to organize before the girls test photo shoot tomorrow. Mick's taking the girls out for a day trip along with Freya and Christina to give them a feel for what's in store on this beautiful island of Palawan. Meanwhile, myself, Andrew, our unflappable art director, and Ken Ken, our head safety diver, are off to scout the perfect location for tomorrow's shoot. Oh, we are uncontactable in the depths of the jungle. Here is about five minutes deep. There's some beautiful fan corals. There's wild sharks cruising past some dugongs. 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 What are those? It's like a sea cow. Manatee yes. in America. We really didn't have to deal with current out there, which is good, but uh, these girls are brand new. They haven't even taken pictures really in the water yet, so we'll see how that goes. We are at a top secret location here. Nick's actually out there right now with one of his young photographers. Let's find him much, much, much wider. And the small is the JPEG. Oh, there is some. He's really helpful. He likes to be out there to direct, give them a good shot. <laughs> okay, this is what you're in your business. All right, thank you, Mick. Make them the best they can be. <laughs> We're getting some beautiful shots with the models. This is great preparation for them for the underwater shoots. Get them comfortable and see how their modeling style is and just make the most of this amazing location here in Palawan.
you looking for the coral right now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, the corals are beautiful. The corals are beautiful. Looks it's like the visibility is not as good as it was. Well, I need on. girls to be trained. Okay, you know, half an hour breathing. This is how it works, Beck. I know, I know. Oh, but this is this is not good. It's I, I just want training before we shoot. So it's a beautiful morning. Uh, we've got the girls down at the beach for the first time. We're going to throw them in the water. The girls have only had paddy training. Uh, they haven't had any specific breath holding or underwater modelling training. So we're just going to see how they go today. The setup today is pretty big. We've got two boats. We have a bunker boat, which is the outrigger boat. Then we have the chase boat, which is a small speed boat, which our divers um, are sort of based in with all the tanks and their equipment. And we put the girls and everyone else on the bunker boat. We're going to be going about uh, 100 feet offshore, maybe a little bit more. And the dive spot we've decided on is about two, five metres deep. But beautiful corals, beautiful fish. Um, yeah, it's a great day. No, please, no cameras, not now. <laughs> you looking for the coral right now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Looks like the visibility is not as good as it was. Okay. No, it's a beautiful day, beautiful day. Yep. Yeah, models, models are here, everyone's on the boat. No, it's great, it's great. No, the corals are beautiful, the corals are beautiful. We saw some awesome fish yesterday. Apparently there's dugongs here, like what more can you want? Come on, it's Back great. Back at 8 o'clock, I need on. girls to be trained. Okay, hang on, I gotta go. All right, I'll talk to you soon, bye, bye. bye. We're just going to do a really brief training session this morning. We've only got Mick for a certain amount of time. So if we just sort of, you know, half an hour, breathing, mask. For me, it's a safety diver bag. I need I need them to be trained before we shoot. Yeah, we're just going to do a test shoot today. Just throw them and see how they go. I really need to train them. Half an hour? One hour. 45. Let's go. Come on, we're wasting time. Kenken's a little upset because we don't have enough time to do the proper training that he wants to do. He should be worried. It's his job. Crystal's having a bit of trouble bit out there. Up. And we're putting him in a tough situation. But just always make All right. it better. Okay, see? All right, Mick is here in two minutes. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> um, okay, what's going on? Uh, we've just had a quick training session with the goals, with oh. the long hose, removing yeah. the mask regulator. How are they doing? Uh, one did well, Ting did quite well, the other two didn't do quite well, Crystal and Lacey. Were little... Define not well. Uh, coming up, sort of coughing, spluttering. Lacey, you okay? Um, yeah, they didn't get it. They didn't really get it as quick as they should. So we're a little concerned about that. But Because I was told that they did so well in the training. How was it? <coughs> they did really well in Paddy and Scuba, but the, you know this is a total different the the modern okay. pack. Well, you know, it's a test yeah. shoot, and so um, the water we have visibility it doesn't look that great to me. Um, we're going out about 100 meters this way, and it is pretty good out there. Um, okay. Yeah, so we should be okay. Generally, okay. the first meter was a little murky, but when you get down, mm -hmm. um, it's quite clear. Nice yeah, corals. But this first meter is murky, then it means I have no light. Yeah, well, let's hope maybe maybe it's blown off. Maybe maybe it won't be there today. The murky that we went through yesterday, but okay. um, it was beautiful underneath. So that's okay. good. Sunlight. Okay. Maybe, back. maybe yeah. I'm totally wrong. <laughs> you are geniuses. So let's, well, let's, let's underwater. Well, the sunlight is great today, and you know, we have almost, you know, straight down. I'm mm -hmm. um, not sure about the visibility. Uh, who wants to go first, Ting? I'll go first. Perfect, <laughs> you know. If I ask you to put on the mask, it is because I want you to read something. Okay. Right? You find the light, you know, doesn't matter where the camera is. That's important for posing. It's not important for your face. Your face should always face the light. You know, when it faces the light, I might choose different angles, but your posing is always angles parallel to the camera. Do we have any 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 weights, any way to choose? Yes, we do. Good, okay. You know, just remember, don't <laughs> panic. 
he's watching you, he's I'm watching you, and you know, if something horrible happens, at least we have it on tape. At the end of the day, be comfortable and we want beautiful photos. So it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be cool. Mm -hmm. Get some, yeah. you know, sexy outfits. And let's just get going. Talking about the usable thing. So if I come out and it's still... Yes, the treasures of the sea. This is my first time going under and we didn't really have that much training. Okay. I haven't really done any breathing techniques. Slow down, relax, let relax. So I'm really nervous about that. Trust us, trust Mick. I'm okay, so just don't think about it too much though, because that can trip you up. Yeah. Thank you. Well, don't feel like you have to rush either. A lot of people feel like they have to rush with the um, regulator. And the challenges underwater is the communication, because if the photographer doesn't like something you're doing, he'll tell you, but underwater is going to be really tough. Freya, we can't find Mick. What do you mean we can't find Mick? Where's Mick? Where's Mick? Visibility is really bad. Shout out Chris, where's Mick? Why? Yeah. Have we lost Mick? No, no. How did we lose Mick? What? Are they with Ben? Tell them. Right here. Ten ten. Ten ten. That's not even Mick. That's Andrew. Where's Mick? We lost Mick. He's below me. No one can find him. We're freaking out. Ben He's below me. Out. Can you please get the girls over here so I can stop swimming in this current? Can we shoot in the current? We can shoot in the current if we have a girl to shoot. He's shooting fish. I believe this is taking so long. I hope one of us at least gets a good shoot. Mix up. Okay, here we go, Crystal, mix up. Okay, Crystal is going in now. Hi, my name is Crystal Kelly, and we're gonna have our first day with Mick. I'm really excited, and I'm so scared. All at the same time, we're gonna be, it's our first shoot with Mick, and I hope we're prepared, and I hope we do a really good job, because I'm really nervous. <laughs> Looks like Crystal's keeping the regulator in way too long. We're not gonna get any shots if she doesn't spit out the regulator. Hi, it's Lacey, and we're getting ready to do our first test shoot. Why is Lacey putting on the latex dress? Who told her to put the latex Lacey, dress on? I don't know what Lacey is doing over there. She's pulling out latex, it's wasting our time. This is her first shoot. It's just supposed to be simple bikinis, and now she's going and complicating it. We should be shooting! So Mick wants to just have us go at it and see how it all works, so it's either sink or swim, and hopefully in this case, I guess it's sink. Mick hasn't asked for anything like that. This is just a test shoot. Are you okay? Yeah. If you sit down, then we can, yeah, we'll move oh, perfect. Okay. Get Lacey in. Mick is waiting. Oh, I want to Time two minutes. Nicole, we just got a wardrobe issue. The uh, latex dress is floating up, so if we can just get a bikini. Are we going to put a bikini on out there or up well, here? Well, she's going to have to put it on. This is going to kill us, guys. She puts the latex dress on with no panties. What does she expect? <laughs> what is the holdup? Get her in now. 
Okay. Chop on, chop off. Yeah, we should have really tested this. This, this is wasting a lot of time. Right? Mixed down there waiting. We've run out of tanks, guys. There's no time to shoot, Lacey. Okay, I have to go. Okay. The shoot's over now. We wasted so much time. Latex. Oh, I screwed everything up. Later. <laughs> I wish. Thanksgiving. I'm loving the hair. He did great poses, but the eyes were a little small. I just you know, like focused on your body, and then I'm like, body, that's where I know you are positioned over there. My luxury body is uh, something great to focus on. No, no, but you should always turn towards the light. So when you, especially uh, Crystal, you did all these wide poses, you know, with the legs and in the angles, very hard. Make it slow motion. Like, you know, whatever poses you do, like, you know, remain, keep a pose, like it would be Tai Chi. And crew, great job! Thank you! <laughs> we just wrapped our first shoot with the girls. Um, Ting did pretty well, Crystal did okay, she had a few ear problems. Lacey decided to throw on a latex outfit right at the last minute and wasn't weighted, so clearly that's going to fly up and that wasted time and she couldn't shoot in the end, so that was an issue. Um, visibility was a major problem underwater. We lost Mick at one stage. They're models, but they're definitely not underwater models yet. So we have an intense training program to put them through, and by the end of that, they should be fine. But today was a good test, and good to see what we got to play with. Okay, training-wise, the girls are going pretty good, so we think they're going to be okay. We have uh, the ring and we have the pole, right? Yes. The pole is over there! Can you confirm that the pole is not as pathetic as yes. last time? Okay. This stuff is not gonna cut. 